Creating a lactic acid bacteria solution for your plants is a powerful way to boost soil health naturally. This process leads to beneficial soil bacteria that enhance nutrient availability, protect plants from harmful pathogens, and improve soil structure. Using lactic acid bacteria also encourages the breakdown of organic matter, helping plants grow stronger and healthier. Let's walk through the simple steps to make this amazing solution at home. First, take one glass of uncooked white rice and add it to a container filled with one liter of clean water. Stir the rice thoroughly to release all the nutrients and starches into the water. Now we aren't going to waste this murky water. Give it to your plants as a treat. The nutrients will give them a little boost. Once you've done that, refill the container with fresh water, stir the rice again, and once more, use the water for your plants. After this second round, fill the container again with water and stir it one last time. This time though, we're keeping the water. Strain the rice and pour the water into a separate container. Now it's time to ferment the rice water. Cover the container with a cloth or a loose fitting lid, making sure it isn't airtight so air can still get in. Leave the container at room temperature for about two to three days. During this time, the natural microbes from the rice water will start to ferment and multiply preparing the perfect environment for the lactic acid bacteria we're about to create. Once the rice water has fermented, it's time to add milk to the mix. For this step, use one part milk, meaning you'll add 100 milliliters of milk to the one liter of rice water we've already prepared. Stir it well to ensure it's fully mixed, then cover it loosely once again and leave it at room temperature. Depending on the temperature in your area, this fermentation will take anywhere from three to seven days. If you're in a climate like ours, where the daytime temperature is around 32 degrees Celsius and nighttime drops to 20 degrees Celsius, the mixture should start separating into solid curds and liquid whey in just three days. Once you see the separation between the curds and whey, it's time to strain the mixture. The liquid whey you strain out is where all the magic is. It's rich in beneficial lactic acid bacteria, which will serve as powerful soil bacteria to help improve your plant's growth and health. You can now store this liquid whey in a clean container and keep it in the fridge. It will stay fresh for several months when refrigerated. To use the lactic acid bacteria solution, add the nearly one liter of this bacterial rich whey to about 15 liters of water before applying it to your plants. This dilution makes it perfect for feeding the soil, promoting plant growth, and keeping your garden in top condition. If you have a larger garden, you can also supercharge the solution by adding brown sugar or molasses to the whey, leaving it for 24 hours, and then diluting it even further to cover more area. The benefits of lactic acid bacteria for soil are numerous. It helps break down organic material faster, releases essential nutrients like nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium, and suppresses harmful microbes. This natural process boosts your soil's health, making your plants stronger and more resistant to diseases. Plus, it's a completely organic and sustainable way to nurture your garden. So by following these simple steps, you can create a powerful soil bacteria solution that will benefit your plants and soil for months to come.